A hybrid car is one which runs on two forms of power, electricity and petrol. When the car is started up, the electric motor, powered by batteries or supercondensers, is set in motion. But once the car begins to accelerate, or once it passes a certain speed, the traditional petrol engine kicks in and takes control progressively until it becomes the sole source of power. The system of power management, a highly complex affair, is dedicated to an onboard computer, which analyzes the speed, the gradient, the charge left in the batteries and the level of brake power in order to determine which motor should be in control of the car at any one time. The proportion of the energy generated in braking or in driving downhill is recycled in order to recharge the batteries. On certain models, the batteries can be recharged from the mains, allowing a greater autonomy for the electric motor. Thus it is possible to travel, especially in town, without recourse to the petrol engine. The advantage of the car is that it limits carbon dioxide emissions, while preserving the autonomy and performance of a traditional car. But its main disadvantage lies with the battery. On the one hand, in order to cut polluting CO2 emissions, an adequate electric autonomy is necessary, and that requires a battery with a large capacity. But on the other hand, the larger the battery, the more expensive it becomes, and, most often made of lithium, a worryingly rare element, it is particularly difficult to recycle.